Let's read our sounds aloud. Th, wh, sh, ch, th, r, o, ear, or, o, o, o. U, u, u. By now you know that sounds build words. Let's go and walk through a couple of sites in America, and while we wander around, we can just as well read some words using the sounds that we've learned. You are going to help me. You are getting very good at it. Well done. Read the sounds. Remember, the more you practice, the better you will become at reading your sounds, words. Sentences, and later, even fun stories. It is freezing cold here in New York. I think we have to read our words to get a little bit warmer. What do you think? Are you ready? Your teacher can put the sound on silent so that you can practice the words all by yourself and get better and better at reading them. Th. 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 Teeth. Shut. Show. Chat, chin, child, dish, that, she, this, rich. Read the h uh, combination sounds. And let's read some H huh combination words. Dolphin Elephant Phone Win Show Wear Photo Who She What Wish You can also follow the link in the description of the video below and use all the printables to help you to present the lesson and to make it interactive and fun for the kids. There are also loads of word cards in every video available to print for your convenience. Just follow the link in the description of the video below. Can you read the sound on Dinny Danny Dragon's tummy? You are quite right, it is the R sound. And this one, can you read the sound? The R, well done, 
Let's read some words. Fern Baker Surf Car Star Far What a view! Fantastic! The whole city skyline of New York City. Let's go and explore a bit of nightlife in New York City. Dinny Danny Dragon is very brave to walk around in the center of New York City. He is also exploring some of the sounds. Can you read the sound on his tummy? It is er. Well done. And this one? Or. You are getting very good. And the last r combination sound? Er. Let's read some words. Sport Sir Girl Dirt For Born Curl Turn Burn It is time to go and visit a very tall lady. It is time to go and visit a very tall lady. Danny Dragon visits one of the most famous statues in the world in New York City, the Statue of Liberty. And yeah, he is able to teach loads of people about the different sounds. Do you know this sound? Oh, that's right. And this one? It also sounds just like oh but now you'll see the difference when we read the words ready raw August because so Paul Author. Let's jump on a train and go to Washington, D.C. Oh, the statue of Abraham Lincoln. Dinny Danny Dragon cannot believe his eyes. Can you read the sound on his tummy? The oo, that's right. And this one? That's correct. It also sounds like oo. Let's read the words and then you will be able to recognize the different sounds in the words. The more you read them, the more you will get used to the sounds. Ready? Here we go. Glue True Juice Suit Fruit Blue It is time to put the words 
into sentences and then the words will get meaning when you read the sentences. Remember to read every day. I will give you loads of reading cards. You can choose one for each day of the week and read aloud. The more you read, the better you will become at reading and the faster you will read very soon. Let's exercise some of the sentences together. This time we'll fly from North America to South America, Colombia in the city of Cali. Ready? Here we go. Father can't help looking at all the colorful flags of Colombia. What a joy! Let's read some sentences with Father. Father sits on the wall. Father wants that book. This is the book that Father wants. Father has very long teeth. Father wants to chat on the phone. Father has a tie under his chin. Mother loves art, so she wants to go and see the big statues in Colombia. Denny Danny Dragon's mother went to visit a very tall statue. She will help us to read some sentences. Will you read with her? Mother looks at the dolphin. When the phone rings, mother picks it up. Mother does not like that elephant. Mother knows who did that. Mother knows what is the time. When will mother be home? She is amazed by the big hands of the statue and she decides to come and show Tom. And look, here is Tom. He wants to drive on the top of the statue's hand. It is so big. Let's rather read some sentences with Tom. Tom wants a red car. Tom can drive very far with the red car. At night, Tom looks for a star. Tom plants a green fern in the garden. Tom wants to serve Dot at dinner time. Tom buys a cake from the baker. What do you think Dot is up to? Ah, oh, Dot, I knew that you are looking for fun, as always. 
That's why you are playing around between the cuts and the colorful flags. Dot is a sweet girl. Dot plays in the dirt for an hour. Dot ties the curl in her hair with a ribbon. Dot has to turn around. I think Dot calls her father Sir. Dot does not like sport very much. I wonder what baby is up to. Let's go and have a look. Her baby is giving everybody some exercise. He wants them to push him around in the colorful streets of Kali, Columbia. Let's read some sentences. You cannot give baby raw food. Maybe baby will become an author. Baby cries because she wants her mother. Baby saw her mother in the house. The paw of baby dragon is green. Baby was also born in August. A grandfather is getting a little bit tired. He wants to stroll to buy everyone a very special souvenir. Let's go and see what grandfather is buying. What a kind gesture. Thank you, Grandfather. I think that everyone will definitely appreciate the souvenirs that you are buying. But first, let's read some sentences before we shop too much. Grandfather has a new hat. Grandfather has new glasses. Grandfather eats his stew. The stew that Grandfather eats is hot. Grandfather has to chew his stew. Grandfather wants to chew his stew. Grandmother finds this a little bit too much. She wants to stroll in the gardens and look at the lovely architecture of the buildings in Kali, Columbia. Let's go and find her. Interesting buildings and flowers and lovely plants. Let's read with Grandmother the last of the sentences. Grandmother has to glue the flowers on her hat. Grandmother does not like a suit. Apples are the best fruit for Grandmother. Apple juice is the best juice for Grandmother. What Grandmother tells us are always true. Grandmother loves the color blue. This was so much fun. I enjoyed reading my sounds, words 
and sentences with Dinny Danny Dragon and his whole family. I hope that you will read every day and then you will get better and better and faster and faster at reading.